Hello, my name is Gabe Kinder. And I'm Tyler Skeet. And we're here to show you a video about how a tennis ball is made. Step one is crushing. This rubber-based core compound made of materials including clay, which deadens rebound, is repeatedly crushed in an open mill for five minutes. Rubber from the compound is collected from rubber trees on plantations in areas like Thailand or Cameroon. This also consists of clay, which is a sedimentary rock formed by weathering of other rocks over time. The clay is mixed with latex, which is composed of 100% pure latex rubber from rubber trees. Then the rubber shell is then covered with a wool or nylon shell known as nap. Compressing. Slugs are cut from the rubber-based core compound, which is then compression molded for 90 seconds into a thin shell. Step 3. Sheeting. Once the slugs are compressed, a sheet is made. This is removed with an air gun, rolled up, left to cool, and cut into semi-circular shells. Step 4. Buffing. The shell halves are combined to make ball cores and are buffed. Placed in a sandpaper lined cylinder to create grooves which add adhesion to the ball. Step 5. Felting. An automatic cutting machine removes panels or dog bone out of a sheet of felt. They are then mechanically stuck to the core. Felt is a textile material that is produced by matting, condensing, and pressing fibers together. Felt can be made of natural fibers such as wool or from synthetic fibers such as petroleum based acrylic or carillon tile or wood pulp based rayon. Blended fibers are also common. The acrylic used in the process to make the felt is consistent and made of making acrylic fibers are synthetic fibers made from polymer with an average molecule weight about 1900 monomer units. For fiber to be called acrylic in the U.S., the polymer must contain at least 85% acrylonatile monomer. Step 6. Inking. The balls get stamped with ink that covers the felt with the brand name of the company and a ball number. Ink is made of color printing primarily based with linseed oil, soybean oil, or heavy petroleum desolate as a solvent combined with the organic pigments. Pigments are made up of salts containing multering nitrogen containing compounds such as yellow lake peacock blue, green, and diarylide orange. Inorganic pigments are also used in printing inks to a lesser extent. Step 7. Pressurizing the balls. The air pressure inside the balls is 12 psi pounds per square inch, greater than ambient air pressure at sea level, the normal air pressure all around you. The ambient air pressure is 14.7 psi, so altogether the pressure inside the ball is 26.7. Invest in these balls. They have a really high return rate.